This is Star 94. I'm Jen Hobby, and we are so excited to talk about the 2022 Give Back Giveaway with our friends at Delta Community Credit Union. And we are excited to connect with Haw Creek Elementary School. <laughs> Hi, Haw Creek. <laughs> How are you all this morning? Good. Good. We are so excited to see you and hear a little bit more about your project. We loved your entry and we loved hearing that you all started a business. Is that right? Yeah. You started a business doing what? Can can one student share with me? Pete, do you want to tell me? Okay, Pete. Pete's going to tell you on his talker what we're doing. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Maggie, no, I'm doing it. I know you're so excited. So exciting. Make dog treats. We're making dog treats. Yes, you are making dog treats. And um, who is Mrs. Brenning? Which one is Miss Brenning? Hey, Miss Brenning. Hi. How are you? I'm good. How are you, Jen? I'm so good. So <laughs> excited to connect with you all. Um, I wanted to introduce you to my friends. Um, right below me in the little square is Marnie from Delta Community Credit Union. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. And right below Marnie is my producers and friends, Alyssa and Ashley hey from Star 94. Hi guys. And our sales rep, Nancy from Star 94 is joining Hi us this morning as well. We all were so excited to get your entry into the Give Back Giveaway. And so Ms. Brenning, will you tell us a little bit more about the inspiration, where the business came from? Because I understand it was from the therapy dogs. Is that right? Yes, we have three therapy dogs on our school campus. We have Ma Maggie. Is she here? Yep. Our Maggie is here family. right now. She is our first customer and our oh. dog. Maggie, Sadie, and Margo, oh, yeah. and we wanted yeah, to treat in. our yeah. special baby. Maggie, come here. Our talent is roaming right now. Here we go. Talent. So That's sweet. My has a functional cooking program, so we cook and teach life skills every Friday. And so we decided that we wanted to start cooking in-house treats for the face of our school, our therapy dogs. And so it kind of just took off from there. So exciting. Marnie, do you have any questions for Hall Creek? Yeah, I have a special guest that wants to say hello. One second. <laughs> hello. Hello. Oh, Lucas, say hello to you. <laughs> this is Fozzie Bear. Well, I'm going to put him down. <laughs> He wanted to just say thank you to all of you kids. Um, animal rescue is very important in our house. Uh, we work directly with some of the local animal rescues here in Smyrna, Georgia. And we've recently rescued a, a dog from Release Atlanta. And so it's definitely a passion of mine. And I'm just so proud of all of you guys. And I want to be your next customer. Oh, yeah. That's so great. Oh, how cool. Uh -huh. So, so awesome. Okay, so I want to hand it over to Alyssa and Ashley. Did you have any questions for our team at Hall Creek Elementary School about their Husky Pack dog treats? I just want to say you all are so incredible. I grew up with an uncle with Down syndrome, and it's so touching what you all do. And it's so beautiful that you all are inspiring everyone to do amazing things. And I just want to tell you guys to keep up all the amazing work. Thank you. I'm excited. All right. And then Nancy, do you have any questions for Hawk Creek or want to um, share anything with them? Um, no, just just echo uh, what was just said. Just thank you so much for um, for getting involved and we love what you're doing and we're excited to uh, help support you. So friends that are there, is there anything else that you want to share with us about your project or about where the funds ended up going? Do you want to share, Kitika, where did we donate our money last month to? To the Humane Society. To the Humane Society. And there's so many dogs and cats and animals that need forever families and need good homes to go to. So I know those funds that you raised were 
really so important in making our community better. And that is what the Give Back Giveaway is all about, because no matter what age, you can serve others in your community. Isn't that right? Yeah. Yeah. Does anybody want to share with me, how did it feel to give back and to help out? How did it feel, guys, to know that you guys gave back? Happy. 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 It made you feel really happy. Well, just remember that you can give back your whole life, and that is what will fill your heart and make you so happy is serving others. And you all are such a bright example of that. So thank you so much for all that you do. And the teachers in the room, thank you so much for all that you do and showing these kids the way. How has it made you feel um, watching them be able to start a business and give back? Uh, personally, I'm overjoyed just watching them grow and their skills and everything that I know they're going to be able to take with them and apply in the real world. I'm like, getting so awesome. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm getting teary eyed with you. Um, what about some of the other adults in the room? How did it make you feel? It's a wonderful feeling just to be able to see them give back and, and help our community. And it's just a wonderful to see everybody so happy. It's just a great experience. Anyone else have any feelings or thoughts they might want to share about the project? <laughs> Are you feeling nervous like the kids? <laughs> I'm trying not to cry. We're so excited, just to be perfectly honest. Yes. To see um, this group of students is truly the best, like most joy-filled classroom on our campus. I've had so much fun getting to know them this year. Um, I'm a first-year principal, so uh, getting to know this class, and they've been so welcoming. Uh, but the work that they're doing is inspiring other students across our district uh, to really say, hey, we, we can do things and we can be leaders in our building. And these students are definitely leaders in our building. Um, and they the way that they're choosing to give back is close to my heart. Maggie is a rescue dog who came from the Humane Society here in Forsyth County. So seeing that they have made the connection to impacting other dogs and other dogs that are going into service is a pretty tremendous opportunity. So it, that is wonderful. And um, Principal, will you come a little bit closer to the, to the screen and to the microphone? Um, and just um, would you mind telling that story? Because I really want to make sure that we capture um, some really great audio of what you explained. So can you talk about um, your service dog, where she came from and making that connection? Would you just mind repeating that part? Absolutely. So my name is Ashley Jonathy. I am principal here at Hawk Creek Elementary School and the class of amazing scholars behind me are the most welcoming humans you could possibly imagine. Uh, when I joined Hawk Creek this year, I was able to bring with me my therapy dog. Her name is Maggie. You can follow her on Instagram at meet.magnolia. She was a rescue dog from the uh, Humane Society here in Forsyth County. She was trained by Scott Rucker to become a therapy dog. And then he trained me to become a therapy dog handler, and she started going to school with me about a year and a half ago. Over the past year and a half, what she's been able to do with students and staff and buildings that I've been in has been incredible. But when we came here to Hawk Creek, watching the students here make their commitment and connection to giving back so that dogs like Maggie have an opportunity to serve in schools across our district is one of the most proud moments of my life. And they are the best kids you have ever met with so much happiness and joy. And they are my, it is my pleasure to get to visit them. But watching them become leaders in our building has been truly an incredible opportunity this year. And I'm just so proud to be here with them today. Wonderful. Thank you so much. And we are so proud of you all as well. So it is quite an honor for me to share with you some really great news today. Okay, Haw Creek Elementary School, of all of the entries across Metro Atlanta, and there were lots of wonderful, wonderful projects, Haw Creek Elementary and your Husky Pack Dog Treats business benefiting the Humane Society in Forsyth County has been selected as the runner-up winner. <laughs> And in second place, that means that our friends at Delta Community Credit Union are going to continue to support your work with $2,000. Congratulations. Now I see the tears. Now, I really, now the tears are flowing. <laughs> well, thank you all so much for being such great leaders and showing everyone that giving back is the best way to feel good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you all so much. Congratulations.
<laughs> and Miss Brenning, I'm going to be in touch with you about making sure that um, you get your money from with Delta Community Credit yeah. Union. I will um, connect you all so you can continue your business and make it even bigger and better next year. And, you. um, and you'll also be featured on Star 94 next week. So share with your community and I can be in touch with you via email about all those details. But it's going to be um, a week from today on Friday that uh, that your story will be featured on the radio and everybody across Metro Atlanta will get to hear about all the good work you're doing. Thank you. Thank you. Great. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, I'm going to let you all do a big group hug. <laughs> Congratulations. Way to go, students. And I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful Thanksgiving. Thank you for making us feel so good by sharing your stories with us. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Congrats.